Good morning, students. Welcome back to the e-learning classes. This is your science period. I hope you all are good. So, students, yesterday we have done the hard words of lesson two, uses of plants. Now, today we will move further to our next exercise, that is, tick the correct answer. All right. So, you all have to write this in your science fair copy. So, all of you be ready with your science fair copy. Please do very neat and clean work. All right. So now let's start our today's work. So students, let's start our today's work. So all of you be ready with your science books and copies. All right. So today we will continue with our exercises of lesson two uses of plants, and uh, the exercise that we are going to do today is exercise A. Take the correct answer. All right. So you all have to write this in your science fair copy. Please do very neat and clean work. All right, and please be careful while writing. Don't do the spelling mistakes. All right. So now let's start. First of all, write down today's date. Today is third, fifth, two thousand and twenty-one. Then on the next line, write down C W classwork and underline it. All right. Then on the next line, you all have to write your lesson number and lesson name. This is lesson number two. L E double S O N lesson two uses of plants. This is your lesson number and lesson name. You will write it and underline it. All right. So the exercise that we are going to do today is exercise A. Tick the correct answer. This is your exercise name. You will write it and underline it. All right. So let's start. Your first question is, which of the following is an example of pulses? So you all have to choose the correct option from the given options. All right. Here options are given to you, so you all have to choose which is the correct answer. So, which of the following is an example of pulses? Is it option A, coffee? Option B, cardamom? Option C, gram? Or option C, mustard? So, which is the example of pulses? Gram. Gram is a type of pulse. that we eat all right it is example of pulses so we will put a tick mark in front of pulse gram because it is a type of pulses okay next one number 2 wheat is an example of which of the following so wheat is an example of which of the following wheat belongs to which uh, category of food is it cereals is it option b pulses is it option c spices is it option d oil so wheat is a cereal pulses or spices we have already discussed during our explanation part so wheat is an example of an cereal it is a cereal wheat barley maize all these are the example of cereals All right, that we eat. I hope uh, it is clear to you all. All right. So now let's move further to the next one, number third. Which of the following plant products is added to the food to enhance flavor? So while we make food, while we are making food, what do we add in order to enhance its flavor what do we do you all must have seen you know, your mothers in the kitchen uh, while the, she is cooking what do she do she add sugar option a sugar option b spices option c fibers option d vegetables so what do we add we add spices spices are added in our food to enhance its flavor okay so our answer will be spices so we will put a tick mark in front of spices 
ओके एस पी आई सी ई एस ओके नेक्स्ट वन नंबर फोर्थ विच ऑफ द फॉलोइंग प्लांट्स हैज अ मेडिसिनल वैल्यू सो विच ऑफ द फॉलोइंग प्लांट्स हैज अ मेडिसिनल वैल्यू प्लांट्स आर वेरी यूजफुल टू अस इट प्रोवाइड्स अस मेनी थिंग्स इट आल्सो प्रोवाइड्स अस मेडिसिनल वैल्यूज सो विच ऑफ द फॉलोइंग प्लांट्स इज हैविंग मेडिसिनल वैल्यूज इज इट तुलसी ऑप्शन ए ऑप्शन बी मैंगो ऑप्शन सी राजमा ऑप्शन डी कॉटन प्लांट सो विच प्लांट इज दिस विच इज हैविंग अ मेडिसिनल वैल्यू इट इज tulsi tulsi is a plant which is used in many medicine tulsi neem all these uh, are the plants which are used for the medicinal purposes all right so our answer will be tulsi so we will put a tick mark in front of tulsi all right so these are the four tick the correct option that you all have to do in this exercise all right students write all the option not only the correct option you all have to write all the four options given then you will put a tick mark all right firstly copy the statement then write all the four options then you will put a tick mark okay i hope it is clear to you all now it's your homework time write down your today's homework your homework is learn exercise a of lesson 2 This is exercise A of lesson two, which we have done just now. You will complete your work and show it to me during your class and get it checked by me. Then after that, you will learn it. This is your homework. All right. So I hope it is clear to you all. If you are having any confusion, you can ask me. All right. so students that's all in this video if you are having any confusion you can ask me and clear your doubts i am here to explain you all right so thank you so much see you in the next video